All right, you're blocking that ladder. So, uh... oh, can you even get out of there? <laughs> I think you're stuck up there, unless we get rid of that mic control. Hmm. Immediate regrets for not having that flashbang. So uh, what can he do? Uh, like, can he run anywhere and still, like, affect? He would need to flank the he Could run sector. to up here. He would need to flank the sector. Also, ah, that's a target preview, okay. So the way I'm reading this, I would not have line of sight on any of the aliens. Um, potentially, oh, we don't have a grenade, so we can't use that either. And I do not believe either of these did anything against the uh, mind control. I feel like one of the better choices might just be to go upstairs, if it lets me. Yeah, there we go. And then, like, start shooting, clear out these three guys. That's an option. And yeah. if we do manage to do that, then just keep running. Since uh, it, I do feel like this is a point where we want to be kind of on the run, but then again, it seems like the camera has moved and our exit is actually the other way. Yikes! Big yikes. <laughs> but yeah, that seems like the best choice right now, so that's what I'm going to do. Go up here. Um, there was no attack opportunity or anything, so that should be okay. We have three shots as well, which is what we kind of need. Unbelievable, but that uh, specialist is still there alive. And then just take some shots, 100%. Let's uh, quickly check. That's not the one we want to kill at the moment. Not this guy either. All of them, no. he can safely ignore. That's, by the way, a very good shot. I mean, yes, but no. Should ignore no. that either. Yes, that no. is good. Wow, almost Gave thought, me a that, for a second there. Almost thought like a that miss. he would miss. Oh my gosh. But all right, all right. I hope he the dream is alive. To take the uh, this is there. one of the ones I wanted to shoot. So um, let's start with the other one, though. Oh, that's uh, not a bad idea. You still have two snipers over there, so you should be able to take out both of them basically for free if I do do not manage to kill this one. Good thinking. Okay. okay. Well, I mean, if we completely miss, then that's unfortunate. All right. Well, uh, Mr. Lambert, what do we do with you? Reload and... I got uh, the impression that the plan was to just book it to the other house. Uh, the issue is, uh, yeah, that didn't quite go as planned. Also, we have no ammo. Hmm. Reload. Not great. And shoot, buddy. Target preview doesn't look too great either here. We have There's one of the two zombies you. outside, if any, available. So, potentially the best choice is just to uh, move and then throw a grenade at this fucker, but that just means more lost are coming in. And it doesn't get rid of this problem over here, which you can't take care of alone. Reload bit of a bit of a lose-lose here. Repeat after me. Um, I will reload and shoot. We can go over there and down, but we can't go up. We could run all the way over there and then just pray that he doesn't get murdered. But that would be a tempting fate for a second turn in a row. Then again, it has worked so far. Um, <laughs> I mean, I most likely have no way of affecting anything that's happening this round. So I'm just going to pass this particular turn to you and see what you want to do out of with the situation. Oh yeah, VIP exists. There is a massive problem right here that we got to take care of. Good. So I at least got this guy. If we were to throw a grenade, that would take care of both of them right here 
Problem with the grenade is might not be able to hit that area. Uh, it's it's a pretty difficult situation. It has evolved over time, but I would give it a a thumbs up for a pretty difficult situation. Moving in to support him. And let's make sure that we're essentially taking care of those two efforts. That seems to kill his area as well. Are you trying to pass to me so I can move out of the way? He should be fine. Good. Problem solved. VIP hunker is down. Let's take a couple of looks here. Nope. 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 Well, we could go over here. Not a great position to be in. We could position ourselves up here. Uh, it would take us probably almost completely out of the fight. We could throw a grenade and essentially hit him, but that won't deal enough damage. I'm considering to change sides over here into half cover. Sunlancer down there definitely is a juicy target. I think we're going to go for that. This loss here originally was on our specialist. No, there was another one down there. I am tripping. Um, let's hit the stun lancer. All right. It's not a great situation. Mm. We have zero targets available can go into full cover at, so at the pylon considering we have a pal here um that is potentially helping us out i feel most comfortable with just reloading and going into overwatch uh, that's not good for so the that's what we're gonna controlled. do you shouldn't do that he is flanked there's one the thing i worry about that is Mrs. Sniper over exactly. here. Exactly, he, he gets it. Wonderful. We would have a very easy shot through the window. He gets it. And I can't actually tell if they have line of sight. I don't think they currently have, do so. They shouldn't be able to shoot with the sniper rifle at the very least, so they shouldn't be able to kill him with one shot. So... <laughs> but he might shoot her when she moves. Oh well. Don't overwatch. Such is life, as they say. No, he overwatches. Oh my gosh. Oh, well, that could end badly. Ouch. Well, that's bad. He's cleaning house. Luckily, he missed. I'm surprised this game's crappy AI actually manages to make use of the free actions. Chris leaves no opportunity. I mean, oh, which is nice. It means he's probably going to waste it on more loss later. Leaves no opportunity unchecked to insult the game AI, and there's the Overwatch. Yeah. 
Luckily, XCOM never hits their own thank watches. God. So thank Question God mark. for that. That is bad. That doesn't look good. Ouch. Did he? <laughs> he just killed Ouch. the VIP and another target. Oh my gosh. Oh, he killed the fucking VIP. Now I'm saddened by the lack of uh, shooting them. Well, that just got really bad. That stinks. We are... It moved from bad to worse. So we're losing the VIP and one of our renowned soldiers. Well, he wasn't renowned. It was Sane, the rookie. The red shirt that was intended to die and now this is where it all goes downhill oh boy all right again a guy with four hp <sighs> We need to kill the sector. Could get over here. No, don't do that. Also, like nobody attacked that sectoid, which is quite upsetting. Um, but he somehow broke out of the stun immediately after getting stunned. Don't move. You only have one. Really, move. only de depriving him of his move action. Oh. We have only one shot, which is of course an issue, since. It doesn't really mean we can take a shot at the Lost and the uh, Stun Lancer. But we could take a shot at the Lost and then run away with him. <clears throat> Wait, what was that about healing things? Let's see. Friendly target. Nope. That's the one. He has lost 2 HP. And I think everyone else has died. Fuck. Um, how much does this heal? 4 HP. That feels like a waste. You don't want to heal. We need to kill now. We're in a world of pain here. Oh. Something happened. Now oh, we're gonna... Take a shot at the lost up here. That is very tempting, I will admit. Do it. Do it. Hmm. The loss does not kill you. Ah, they're just gonna swarm him if I leave him there. Okay, these lags are like seriously stressing out my heart. Um, boom, boom, boom. He could go there and probably pull another pod. Seems like a great idea. Uh, we'll just get slightly closer to our comrade, like over here. Because I still don't think reloading is the greatest idea there, so. <laughs> Retreat for a turn. That sniper is yours. What's this? This is my other guy. And I think that's the only ones we have currently. Freaking mind control. Every mission. <laughs> Every mission it wrecks us. At least she has no more grenades, I believe. Um, probably gonna shoot that friend next to us, but he has 4 HP, so we can't guarantee he'll die. We can't go into this building because we have our sniper in there. All mind control like. Uh, and we can't exactly move out. How the hell do you jump down like that? Because I do feel like you deliberately broke this down so they couldn't come up uh, from that way. The problem is 
Yeah, what are we going to do with that particular uh, advantage? It's a difficult spot. He would need you to You have take... me confused. He would need to take cover. Um, we have three shots. And take a shot at the lost. We could That's move right to move. here. Um, probably to here, actually, if we can. That would be... be somewhat safe. Unfortunately, that soldier over there will have cover against us. But we could move here, try to take this one down. And then if we do manage that, we could also take a shot at him and still have cover from our sniper. Not a bad spot. No, it's still really shit. There's there's so many lost. But that's the best I can come up with. So that's what we'll do. I don't see any particularly... Yeah, juicy hiding spots, so... Move to there, yeah, according to the preview. See. I do not have line of sight on them when I go there. Next. Dang it. Hmm. If he chooses the corner... Oh, Here. oh look at that, he found out. That looks decent. That's the best spot, that's the play. Let's go over there. Now, what is that yellow alien there that we're apparently flanking? It's the that is the mind control alien, but that is also an extremely unlikely kill, if it is at all possible to kill him, so... No dice! And instead, we're gonna try our luck here. Three to five, we need four. Yeah, correct. Choice. And a hit, of course. Sure. Fantastic. That's, that's bitter. Up to you. Alright, that's not great. There are no great odds here. But we can start taking out that guy. And we need to deal with the stun lancer. I can't even move, which is ridiculous. That's the play. At least the sniper is doing work. That's going to be a re revive. Even more zombies. Couple of shots, but unfortunately, oh, fortunately for us, uh, they missed. After this round, the mind control is over, by the way. Which is awesome. That sniper is holding their ground. Just like they're supposed to. Our mind controlled sniper, however, is starting to offer herself up um, as a potential target, which is mean. The AI is toying with us at this point. That's a pretty de decent shot. Almost killed the stun Good lancer. Good job, I guess. Oh, oh God. shit, we're getting pounded. And even more lost. Just for the lols. Well, 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 this is a perfect uh, example of how to make a bad situation even worse. Probably going to lose our sniper now. She gets attacked. Well, well, well. Somehow the loss did nothing except just 
become more lost, which isn't exactly great. But I guess it could have been worse. All right. Uh, well, we have no VIP to evacuate, but as we've already found out, these guys run faster than our guys, so we can't exactly run run. away. Um, let's reload for the moment. Exactly. And then have a look at our chances. It's pretty good. This guy probably for last, just in case we get a five damage hit. Yeah, that's all of them. Okay. Alright, Chris is doing work. I gotta congratulate him. He remains his cool even under pressure. It's my thinking here. Uh, the Dasher, we can have a sniper take out with a free action. That shouldn't be the problem. Uh, still, really. Okay, actually, it would be useful to heal her, so. That is uh, just a melee ranged medkit, it appears. That is Unless true. I missed something. I don't believe so, so. Can't really heal her. Keep on shooting, buddy. Let me see here. Like, no, I can't seem to target anybody else then. Him? Okay. Um, we do have nobody else under control, actually. There's very little control at the moment in this situation. Um, <clears throat> can you take your sniper and quickly take a shot at that one guy in the room? So that's uh, off the table. I mean, with the gun in the room, if you can reach him. Because if you don't have line of sight, that would kind of ruin my plan. I guess that answers my question. Yeah, All right. There is no one. I think I can't reach him. No. Yeah, you have no line of sight on that guy. All right. Oops. Let's try that again. There we go. All right. In that case, this guy's next. Chris is doing a fantastic job. And then we kind of need to hope for the damage jackpot on the big guy. Because as far as I recall, if we quickly check here, your sniper rifle does how much damage? Four to six. So you have a slightly better chance of killing the big guy right next to you. Um, what he does know is that sniper rifles in melee are shite. But you're also dead if you get hit. And I do not believe Comp Protocol is actually going to give us a headset re headshot reset. Nope. So guaranteed hit. One in three chance, I guess, to kill him. That's true. Not great odds, but... Gotta give it a try. Did you miss? No. Lag Look again. at nice. that. He's going to be... Hunk is going All to right. be the MVP here. Run away or take another shot. Take another shot, buddy. Potentially set this guy up for a kill. I think that is the best choice we got here. So... fucking lootly. Take shot. Holy crap. Oh, that was a 96% miss. Well... All right. Well... Even the game doesn't believe I just missed. <laughs> Classical XCOM denial. Moving to designated coordinates. Nope, not going to target the Psy zombie. Actually, we'll let the Lost uh, do their thing down there. Yeah, let's hit this guy. Of 
before we're doing anything. That's a shitty chance. But that's the only one uh, that I do have. We're probably going to lose the sniper. Alright, I do have an idea. This here is another candidate. So running to him will give us one more body on the field. Sniper can't really do much, he's out of ammunition at this point, would need to reload, so multiple turns of inactivity. And there we go again. At least the enemies don't I feel like the game is just taunting me for at the very start saying, ah, oh, we're not gonna need any Psyop countermeasures. It'll be fine. Bunch of pricks. Well, 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 the game certainly taunts him, that's for sure. XCOM is a cruel and devious mistress, but that's what we like is, about her. Is that our operative? Oh, that's actually the VIP that just got revived. Hopefully, they are targeting some of the sectors. Yes, they do. So that could be fun to watch. Let's see if um, if they actually kill someone. There we go. Because fuck you. You didn't finish the job. Now Why has, couldn't you finish the he job? He has a grenade. He just needs to throw down the Damn grenade. Damn it. Okay. Um, let's have a look here. He just needs to throw down the grenade. No, you went one too far. Let's try it again. 57%. Or a grenade. Throw the grenade. Which we do have. If Very he, tempting. If he reloads and throws the grenade, that would be... Take out optimal. this guy as well as uh, four lost. No, three lost. Um, And maybe before that, just take a few shots on the other side. Well... 78%. These are not great hit chances. They really aren't. That's 100%. But that's also kind of a friend of ours, considering what he did. Uh, could take out one guy. Two guys. Three, that's almost stretching it there, but might have to do that and then throw a grenade down. But then again, we wouldn't have to shoot these two guys in the first place. Reload and throw the grenade, but um, that's the right play. And I do not believe we have a stock. What we do have is the kill protocol that we could use to kill Miss Marvel. Let's see. That's true. Does that actually ignore line of sight? It does not. Okay. So, no ammo. So, first, first course of action is pretty obvious. Got to reload. This one's free, these ones are not, but they are close to it, and we're definitely not doing that. So it is tempting. They obviously don't feel like being on our side. <laughs> Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Tough. Tough. Throw the grenade, buddy. I know that that's right. Could run all the way over there and do nothing. It seems like a bad idea. Or we can try and wait one more round, all things considered. Like, she actually has a class. He's a rookie. So, uh, he's probably gonna have to sacrifice himself here, potentially. One shot. Just throw the grenade. Or just a grenade. Now I feel like it has to be a grenade. Yes. Very good. 
just wow, to that's so intense. That, that, is, that is even more intense uh, than me playing alone. Purge the Xenos. Um, I cannot tell if that hits the alien. It does. Let's try a different angle here. Like he doesn't light up in the same way, but I think that means it hits him. Yes. Surely that's what that means. Yeah. Nothing else nearby. Nope. Good shit. He just forgot to reload. The rest was really well played. Next loss, Swarm be done. Damn, I don't want more mind control. All right. Um, I think, yeah. Thank you. That guy still has some actions. Um, what did we have? We had some decent hit chances over here, really. Uh, he can't really move and shoot anyway. And we can't use our combat protocol. What I will do is just... Okay, that was weird. Just in case, let's have a look at your sniper over here. Could they move to him and potentially get healed? Probably not, until, unless they move, use all their movement. So for the moment, I'd like to see what you want to do. And if you want me to take over again, you just switch back to my guy. Good. That gave us an additional out. In that area. You should be clear to move for 100, 100, 99, 85, and this guy here is the target. Good. Let's start with the 100%. We're leaving the other one for bait down there. Let's try to get the advent. There we go, that's the spirit. There we go. It's back to Chris. We cleared everyone ab uh, above. Oh boy, and this is an intense mission. I mean, we already lost the VIP, which sucks, but we can still get two decent soldiers out of it if we get the F out of here. Ah, uh, don't get too close. Gotta group up. That's a good position. That's also a good idea. Chris is not saying anything. I suppose he has muted his mic and is not um, knowing about that. Well, I'll keep on commenting in the meantime. He appears to be thinking about going for an Overwatch. Yep, that's maybe also not a bad idea. Oh, I was muted the entire time while I was talking. Fantastic. Um, yeah, decided to Overwatch because somebody might come up. The other choice was to book it, essentially. That was my bad. Had the microphone on mute. Good. Thank very fuck, good. it's not in my control. Very good. So they are still trying to mess with them. Unfortunately, slowly but surely. I mean, I was right about someone coming up, unfortunately. Aim 
is still complete garbage. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, this is getting out of hand. You just can't win. <laughs> oh, they spawn at the extraction. <laughs> oh, you're killing me. Well, well, let's see what Chris is going to do. Okay. The right play here is to now get the F out of here. Grand. You also seem to have like no interest in taking out the like last few uh, aliens that are still around. So his ammo is still garbage. At one shot, he has a lot of targets, admittedly. And we probably want to at least take that ninety-two percent shot. Oh, it is potentially a waste if uh, you have line of sight with one of your guns. Let's have a quick look here. This lady, and just need to be careful not to press anything unfortunate. Yeah, you should have line of sight on that one, so... Gonna leave that alone, probably. Um, actual, like, aliens with guns. There's really only one left. Two down there. There's another sector. One guy he probably is doesn't have that on the radar. Down there. So while they could reposition and shoot up, they also have a lot of other targets around. And as far as I understand, this would block the ladder. And then we could like take a shot at this guy. And then probably would have to reload or maybe keep running. So that seems actually like a pretty decent choice. Just a lot of freaking zombies around. Surely I will not regret this choice. Alright, he's moving up. Lots of enemies now. Turn ends when I reload, so one moment. Um, huh. I will wait with his action until the end, I believe. That is one of yours. That is one of yours. That is my dude. Quick aim check, 98%, 2 HP, 94%. There's an 89 with 3 HP. Yeah, let's do this guy. Yeah, you never know well. what they were in life. Oh, nice. You survived and you leveled up. Still 89% chance to hit, though. 90% hit chance. That is very difficult to miss. So, uh, surely you won. He didn't. Impressive. Okay. Uh, could reload and keep shooting. We could not potentially like run over here. Wow, Chris is getting super Have some aggressive. good uh, shooting next round since the loss that we saw spawn probably will try and move up into this area. I or we could try and reload an overwatch, but I would like to see what you do to all of these 2 HP enemies that are currently here since you are in control of all the pistol uh, people. So please go ahead. Um, let's see. So I'm taking over, and the first uh, thing that we're going to do is, of course, moving up, getting a bit closer. Headshotting the targets that we can. Good. And given the rest of our setup we're going to reload we know there are still enemies down there plenty to be honest
50-50 to get this, uh, this guy, which I think is a fair approach. Uh, the other option could be to simply move up here and take an overwatch, which I think I'm going to prefer. He still has targets downstairs. And we need to get to the exit. I want to signal to Chris more so than anything that we're, uh, that we're in the need of a tight formation here. So there's an overwatch right there. And as for our shotgunner, let's put him in a really decent position and give him an overwatch. All right. I am slightly confused. Damn, and I wanted to One signal. option I thought might be the case is you trying to get that heal. But that doesn't seem to be the focus. So considering we're establishing a pretty strong overwatch position here, I feel like that might be the correct choice here. Yes. To reload. Or potentially aid protocol. I guess we could reload and aid protocol her, actually. If you do have line of sight. Else will overwatch. Considering that saved one of my soldiers' asses. Let's hope that still is the case. Nice. He's replicating what he has learned. Not really needed in this situation, but still, I give him props for... And like... then you, my friend, we really have not that many options. We have no more targets available. Don't stand in the open. There's one dangerous enemy downstairs, which is that one soldier. Um, we have one overwatch with pistol here, and we could do another one with our uh, rifle, getting two shots on the 4 HP soldier. Uh, once they probably choose to run out and try to get a shot, but that puts him in a very precarious situation exactly. of getting shot. You don't want to do that. She's pretty safe, so I feel like the, the, the safe play is to uh, move in. It seems like... We actually took quite heavy positions against getting shot at, too. So I don't feel too confident in staying too far out in the open. That's a good play. Um, if the soldier's coming in, he's coming from this direction. So I probably want to be in here. Good. Well, that's a decent spot. Yeah. Okay. Still no reloading. So we got finally a dense formation again, which had been missing for a while. This guy might need to reload soon, maybe. Continuous overwatch, that's fine, okay. Let's see what There's the still a uh, sectoid alive. Completely forgot about that. Yep, Chris now realizes that there is a sectoid. And it doesn't look like they acted much either. You could have you could have aimed at the guy next to you instead of the I guy all the way on the other side. The that would have been useful. Exact same thing. Like how incredibly stupid was that? All right, are they going to hit and kill the sector down there? Well, they certainly hit uh, the... They certainly hit the uh, zombie. 